Maruza is a small South American country located between Chile and Argentina. Maruza has been governed by a military dictatorship for a long time. Surveillance, arrests, tortures, assassinations, and genocide. The people are dispossessed of their rights and freedom and are kept on a chain of fear. The one person to shine a ray of hope onto this long period of darkness is Pachamama, the daughter of the first president of Maruza. The people started the democratic movement with her as a symbol of freedom. The movement expanded nationwide thanks to her warm personality. Tomorrow is the Maruzan Independence Day, and the way of the democratization is just reaching a climax. I have taken this flight to cover Pachamama, the leader of the democratic movement. Kato, maybe we should get the interview with Pachamama before we land. What do you think? Maybe you're right. It'll be hard to interview her once we land. Miss Pachamama, uh, sorry to disturb your rest, but tomorrow is Independence Day and there is considerable conjuncture that a revolution might break out. Your opinion, please? A revolution? I don't think so. I just hope for a fair election. Uh, how about... Hey, déjala sola. Excuse me. I really would like to rest for a while. Can I continue this interview at the airport then? And my name is Kato. I'm a journalist from Japan. Mr. Kato, I see. I'll try to remember. Hey, look outside. The Andes look spectacular. Your love of mountains really amazes me. It's almost an addiction if you ask me. Descansar un momento. Entonces, te traeré una manta. crashed. Are there any survivors besides me?
Esta llave... Okay? Hey, listen. This crash was no accident. This has been planned from the beginning. You've got to reveal the truth. Okay, okay. Don't talk anymore. If you reveal the truth, you'll win the Pulitzer Prize. Uh, uh, the credit is all yours this time, but... Make sure you thank me later, okay? Uh, uh, Hang on! Nakayama! Nakayama! Pachamama! 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 It looks like our plane crashed in the Andes. What are you talking about? I know you. Yes, I'm Kato. Did you get hurt? I, no, I'm fine, I think. Are you all right? Yes, I'm okay. I'm used to snow-covered mountains. There should be other survivors. Let's find them.
This is fucking great. Why me? Are you all right? Who are you? Are you a survivor from the crash? There is someone else. A Japanese man. Hey, don't I know you from somewhere? Uh, never mind. Shit. I'm completely out of luck. I was this close to getting back to headquarters in the States. What are you talking about? You are lucky to be alive. If you are not injured, please help me look for other survivors. Okay. I'm Steve, an engineer from the States. What is your name? I'm Pachamama. The snow is very deep here. I'll have to make a path.
Thank you. I'm Julia, a journalist from the States. I got arrested in Bosnia last year, and now my plane crashes this time. I must be out of luck. I'm Steve. I'm also from the States. I work for a multinational corporation as an engineer at a local office. I'm Kato, from Japan. I'm also a journalist. I thought that you were a mountaineer. I used to be, but now I'm in the same line of business as you are. I'm Pachamama. The leader of the democratic movement that will win back freedom from the military regime of Marusa. Everyone calls you the Statue of Liberty of Marusa. You're the only hope for the people under the rule of the military. So that's why I thought I'd seen you before. I do not think that the crash was an accident. Why do you think so? I've been targeted for assassination many times in the past. This crash might... We ought to consider our next moves rather than worry about the cause of the crash. When airplanes crash in mountain regions, the search for survivors usually takes longer than you would expect. What? Are you saying the rescue party is not coming right away? There's no guarantee that they would find us immediately. What would happen to us if they didn't find us? That's why we have to find a transmitter. If we can make contact, they will find our location more quickly. He's right. Let's find a transmitter. Go first to see if the bottom of the cliff is safe. Oh, oh dear. Hmm. Ah.
¿Dónde está Pachamama? Stop the bleeding from your injury soon. But it's cold out here. I'll put you on that seat. There you go. Thank you. 
shit. Where the hell is the rescue party? What's that sound? It's a helicopter. It's the sound of a helicopter. Are they government troops? shooting at us! Aren't they supposed to rescue us? They might have mistaken us for someone else. Who the hell did they mistake us for? Uh, that's no excuse! Maybe they mistook us for rebel guerrillas based in the mountains. I got an idea. We can use a transmitter to let them know. Let's talk to them right away before they circle back around. What can we do? What do you think? We've no choice but to look for a battery. But where should we look? I don't think it's on this side of the valley. If it had fallen on this side, we would have found it already. Uh, they're back. Better move to the other side anyway. Well, what should we do about him? We'll be caught if we take him with us. Oh, be the day, Timmy. How about drawing their attention as we run? They should follow us. Uh, oh. Everyone looks okay. Oh, yeah. Now I just hope I find a battery somewhere around here.
tenéis de llevarla de vuelta. Los otros sobrevivientes deben ser exterminados. Por favor, venga con nosotros. Maruzan government planned the crash as well. Are you saying that we have nothing to do with this and we just got caught up in your fucking war? Steve, cut it out. We don't have time to quarrel among ourselves. We have to concentrate on finding our way out of this. She's right. Pachamama, you'll have to tell us all the details after we get rid of that helicopter.
tenemos. ¿Estás bien? No deberías sentir pena por mí. Si tú mueres, Merusa morirá contigo. Merusa volverá a la era de las tinieblas, cuando el miedo lo controle todo. Tú no puedes morir, pase lo que pase. Por los compañeros que sacrificaron sus vidas por este movimiento. Y por la gente de Merusa. Ah. Sobrevive y tienes que bajar esta montaña. Por favor, salva a Merusa, nuestra madre patria. Ah. What? Her? There's no doubt about that. The government army planned the crash as well. Why do we have to get caught up in this crap? We're not even fucking Marusen! It's such a mama's fault! If you hadn't been on the flight, it would never have crashed! I'm so sorry. You don't have to apologize for anything. It's the Marusen government army's fault. I've got an idea. If they want her, we should simply turn her over to them. What do you say? How could you be so mean? That's the most absurd idea I've ever heard. We're witnesses. They've never let us live. I agree. Turning her over to them will not solve anything. Since we can't expect a rescue party now, we'll have to get off this mountain on our own. Unless we stick together and cooperate, we will never get out of this. Uh, shit! Pachamama is fluent in Spanish. She might be of use sometime. Let's get off this mountain together with her. Okay, Steve? Yeah, yeah. It's another government army helicopter. It must be headed for the crash site. We can't go back there again. Let's move off right away. The mountain trail is cut off. What do we do? We can't go anywhere. Hey! Who is he? Are you all right? Yeah. Were you on the plane? Yeah. Have you seen any other survivors? No one survived around me. You should get away from here. Right away. The government troops? Yeah. They are after us. Kato, let's move on. Can you stand up, Mr... It's Lopez. I'm Kato. Nice to see you, Kato.
Across the crevice now. Now we can stop whoever is following us.
for help. Talk to me, Steve. The output is too weak. Uh, we can't use this in the mountains. Useless in the mountains. 
Wait a sec, Steve. I hear something. Let me hear it, please. Uh, scouting party. Scouting party. It's their military transmission. We have reached the point about 100 meters below you and are standing by for instructions. What? Mm. Just 100 meters? They are just around the corner. We have to take another mountain trail to move down before they spot us. Let's hurry. the government army communications facility. I've got an idea. Maybe we can call for help from the base. Hey, wait a minute. Didn't you say that it's a government army facility? That's suicide! I don't think so. This facility is poorly guarded. We can sneak in. Hey, miss. How do you know so much? What? How do you know the location of the government army base? I am a journalist. I can't reveal my sources. Okay. Even if we got access to their transmitter, who the fuck should we call? Is there anybody who'd come up here in the snow? Yes, there is one. I know someone we can turn to. What? There are some units in the government army sympathetic to us. I know one commander who fought with my father for independence. He will help us. Okay, let's go to the communications facility, as Julia says. We can keep descending on this route, can't we? Yeah.
es de armas de fuego, ¿no? Posiblemente es el grupo de exploración que está cortando las comunicaciones. ¡Vamos! Now we can see if our plan worked. Were they killed? We've got no time to lose. Let's move to the communications facility. Okay. It should be a bit further ahead in this direction. Who would build a communications facility on the edge of a cliff? Shh! Don't talk so loudly. There might be someone around here. I hope it hasn't fallen into the hands of the government troops yet. Quite possible. I'll go scouting alone to make sure. Are you sure you'll be okay on your own? I'm sure. Hey, Julia. Are you really a journalist? How come an American journalist knows so much about a facility in a remote region? I don't have time to explain it to you. Our immediate priority is to get access to a transmitter, isn't it? I'm going.
This is it. Even if there's a soldier, he is just a communications man, right? He's not as simple as that. He's also armed. We have to be cautious. As soon as we call for help, it'll be over. Oh, let's get it over with quickly.
Verificando el sistema de seguridad. Es extraño, no hay fuego. Oh, otra vez está estropeado. Estoy harto de este panel de mandos. Hold it against us, man. We just want to use your transmitter for a while. Be my guest. But I didn't expect to see Pachamama still alive. That means more work for us. So the government troops did plan the crash, just as we suspected. Of course. The plan was to assassinate you and make it look like an accident, Pachamama. Oh, how dare you! You have killed many innocent people! If your assassination plan is revealed, you will never retain political power, since the whole world will not tolerate such an act. Not only did you fail in assassinating Pachamama, but you also got some witnesses to your crime. So you decided to kill us all to keep our mouths shut. You are a fast learner. <laughs> and reinforcements are hitting this way, even as we speak. <laughs> Hey! What are we waiting for? Let's call for help and get out of here! You'll never get away. What do you mean? Until then, enjoy your soon-to-be-over lives.
Ready to transmit. Give me the frequency. It should be 589.27. Somos los sobrevivientes del vuelo 203. Respondan, por favor. ¿El vuelo 203? Entonces Pachamama está viva. Aquí, Pachamama. Por favor, informe al coronel Casares que estoy viva. Coronel, tenemos en línea de emergencia a una persona que dice ser Pachamama. ¿Qué? Pachamama, ¿eres realmente tú? Sí, señor, estoy bien. Dime tu localización actual. Estoy llamando desde una instalación de comunicaciones de las tropas, situada a mitad de camino del Aconcagua. Señor, ¿puede venir a rescatarnos? Estamos bloqueados por las tropas del gobierno y las montañas. Entendido, ya estoy preparando vuestro rescate. Preparen un helicóptero para despegue urgente. Gracias a Dios estás bien. Los rebeldes están preparando un golpe de estado en la capital sobre tu asesinato. Si no pudieras volver a la capital el día de la independencia, este país sufriría una guerra civil. Lo sé. Tengo que volver a la capital lo antes posible, para evitar que estalle una guerra civil. Por ahora todavía tenemos tiempo. Si la gente te ve, la situación se calmará. Hay grupos de tropas que se dirigen hacia ti. Enviaremos un helicóptero lo antes posible. Deberemos recogerte cerca del glacial Santa María. Rescue is coming. Let's go to the Santa María Glacier. All right. We made it. We can't waste time. The government troops are coming. Right, yeah. What shall I do with this guy? There's no reason to kill him. Leave him as he is. You are right. Then... Making sure that he can't contact the government troops. I'll destroy the other instruments as well. You guys go ahead and prepare for departure. Okay. <laughs> I smashed them totally. Excellent. Let's move to the Santa Maria Glacier. Walking. The foot of the slope is the rendezvous point with the rescue party. Hey, listen. Hey, check with the walkie-talkie to make sure they're on our side. Soy una de las sobrevivientes del vuelo 203. Adelante, por favor. Este es el helicóptero de la base de Cagua. Se busca recoger a los sobrevivientes. Por orden de todas las cajas. Señorita Pachamama, está todo bien. It's okay. The helicopter is on our side. Oh, thank God. We're safe at last. What are we waiting for? Let's go down to the snow field.
the hell happened? They're coming this way. Get away. Get away? Where the hell should we go? This way. It's closer to the roof down. our radio transmission. Steve, you double-crossed us. Give me a break. I scrambled the transmission. They couldn't have intercepted it. Then how come they were waiting for us? How the fuck should I know? You had the transmitter. You double-crossed us. Double-crossed my ass. Chill out, guys. Ugh. We've got no time to fight among ourselves. The government troops are still on our trail. They're going to catch up with us unless we hurry up. What we do? We gotta slow them down for a while. You guys go ahead. I'll catch up soon.
We're in trouble! What's going on? The government troops are already at the bridge! They'll put out the fire in no time! No exit on this side, and the government troops are on the other side. We are like rats in a trap. down was buried, didn't you? And how come a journalist knows about a remote base and route in the middle of the mountains? Oh, first of all, no journalist could kill a man with a knife like you do. As far as I'm concerned, you are the traitor! I simply use my ability to survive, that's all. I don't expect any gratitude. But I have done nothing to deserve being called a traitor. Hey, we gotta work together and find a way to get off this mountain before they put out the fire. Once they cross that bridge, it'll be over for us.
light. It looks like this shaft leads to the other side of the mountain. Everyone, listen. What did he say? The fire is almost out. Eliminate the survivors as soon as possible. Oh, they will catch up with us soon. Oh, shit! They're going to catch up with us even if we get to the other side. Oh. Hey, there's some dynamite. We might be able to bring the bridge down. There's no time to lose. Let's hurry. Unless I get to the capital by Independence Day, it will be in vain. What are you waiting for? 
Let's move! got away from the government troops all right, but we've no hope of being rescued. What the hell should we do? We have no choice but to get off this mountain on our own. On our own? We've got no equipment or food. How can we possibly get off this mountain on our own? This is a mine. Hmm. There might be something useful here. If we have to get off this mountain on our own, we will never make it by Independence Day. And if I don't make it, civil war will break out in this country. If war is inevitable, I should have been assassinated. Then many innocent people wouldn't have to get caught up in this war. <laughs> you can't be serious. It's true that many have sacrificed their lives for you. But that's why you have to live. Don't give up now. Giving up means dying in the mountains. People need you, Pachamama. I'm so sorry. I must be losing my mind because so many things have happened in such a short time. Listen up, guys. Don't give up. We've got only one option, and that is to get off this mountain on our own. Understood. But how come the government troops can anticipate our every move? What are you saying, Lopez? saying that we've got a rat on board. It could be me, or it could be Julia. Or maybe you are the rat, Lopez. But it is pointless to start suspecting each other in this situation. We don't have any evidence to name the rat. What we should do instead is get off this mountain as quickly as possible. Let's move, everyone. This looks pretty old to me. I'll go first to see if it's safe.
Forget about her. She is just too... Steve! You can't be serious. She must have told our position. It's just too weird for a journalist to know about the communications facility. And she is too experienced in using a knife and explosives for a journalist. But she fought against the government troops with us. Maybe she did it to get information from you. It still does not prove that she's the traitor. I will go find something to help her by myself. Hmm. Okay, okay. Let's help her for the time being. You're okay. Thanks. What was that rumbling anyway? A cave-in. Julia strapped inside the shaft. What? She's at the far end of the shaft. She'll suffocate unless we move Jeez. fast. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, all we have to do is pull this up. Guys, lend me a hand. Please don't break now. Can I ask a question? What do you want to know? I'm not just speaking for myself. Everyone thinks that maybe you are the traitor working for the government army. You are too experienced at using a knife and explosives for a journalist. I don't want to pressure you, but if there's something you are hiding from us, I would appreciate it if you told us. Hmm, I see. Maybe it's too dangerous to keep it a secret. I am a secret agent for the United States Central Intelligence Agency. I took that flight on a mission to keep Pachamama under my surveillance and protection. CIA? The CIA is supporting the rebel forces? The current regime placed mining and other industries under state control. This is highly undesirable for American-owned multinational companies. Then you are simply looking for concessions, not for democracy. You can't be that naive. That's our usual position. It's natural for capitalist nations to hunt for concessions, isn't it? For concessions? My mission is still to keep you under my protection. Personally, I don't want to see this country go into a state of civil war. I'm on your side. I see. That explains everything. If you are a CIA agent, you have access to satellite surveillance photos. So you knew the location of the communications facility. Uh, Julia, <laughs> I was wrong about you. <laughs> I'm sorry that I doubted you. <laughs> Never mind. I thought you were the one that passed our position to the government army, remember? Thank you for rescuing me, Steve.
Okay, get out of the shaft and get back to safe distance. Still blocking the way. Nice job, Kato. Let's get out of here. We've got to reach Memorial Square as soon as possible. Mamá, nuestro pueblo fue atacado por tropas del gobierno. ¿Qué? Habíamos oído que su helicóptero fue derribado, por eso íbamos a buscarlo. En ese momento vinieron a nuestro pueblo y, y uh, ellos y empezaron a actuar. La base de Pisagua fue también destruida. Oh no. No lo podremos lograr para el día de la independencia. No será posible para esta guerra civil. Pero... Hay... Un... Helicóptero en... En nuestro pueblo. Saya, no hable. Vaya, mamá. Usted es la, la única esperanza... Para salvar Merusa. This should be the place. Maybe it is hopeless, after what that guerrilla soldier said. We cannot desert them, no matter what happens. We have to save this village, otherwise his death will be in vain. But we don't have any weapons, guys. What can we do for them? This is also our only option. 
Oh, yeah? Why is that? The government troops already occupy every route off this mountain. So the only way to get past them is to take a helicopter in this village. We have no option but to advance. That's just great. Damned if you do, damned if you don't. Yes. Okay, let's decide our future, guys. Let's go.
Oye, piden refuerzos. Mierda, ahora es nuestro turno. Son unos bastardos. We can't penetrate them like we did before. with the outfit. I'll go scouting to see what the government troops are doing. Maybe I can find something to help us find a way out. You might be fluent in Spanish, but it's too dangerous. They might recognize your voice. I am aware of that risk. But getting into action and fighting myself is the only way to repay those who have sacrificed their lives. Let me do this, please. It's the least I can do.
ha pasado con el guardia de la entrada? Están pidiendo refuerzos. ¡Vamos! ¡Ey! 
This truck is full of gunpowder and ammunition. We could set off some pretty loud fireworks with this, couldn't we? Hey, Steve, can you make a timing device? Hmm. Uh, I'm not sure if I have the proper materials, but I'll try. <laughs>
Okay, I'm hot wiring the engine. Everyone get back. Mamá, nunca pensé que usted nos rescataría. Pero los que merecen todo el crédito son ellos. En cualquier momento puede estallar una guerra civil entre el ejército del gobierno y las fuerzas rebeldes. A menos que usted se presente en la plaza conmemorativa de la independencia. Lo sé. Tengo que llegar allí tan pronto como sea posible. Nuestro helicóptero está en las afueras de la villa. Por favor, úselo. Solo usted puede cambiar esta nación. Let's go, Pachamama. Yes. Suerte. Gracias. Take a detour then. Lopez, you. What? You are the traitor? <laughs> That's a matter of opinion. I just joined your little picnic for a while. Hey. You, spy from the CIA, fly this helicopter. Are you after Pachamama as well? That's one way of putting it. It doesn't matter to you, does it? <laughs> I enjoyed your picnic. Now. Give me a ride home. Sure. Where are we heading for? The Allende base. You know the location, don't you? Lopez was the traitor. There's no time. I have to find Pachamama.
some sort of control room.
Kato, can you hear me? The air duct leads here. If you use it carefully, they'll never spot you. Pachamama should be somewhere beyond there. I could never do it myself, though. <laughs> I don't do small, dark places.
haces pasar las moradas, Pachamama. Por fin puedo hablar contigo sin obstáculos. López, tu objetivo es matarme. Por Dios, ¿de qué quieres hablar? Es verdad, las tropas de gobierno te quieren muerta. Pero ese no es mi objetivo. ¿Qué? Mi objetivo es aniquilar a la guerrilla en las montañas. López. Bueno, ¿dónde está la base de operaciones? No tengo ni idea. No puedes hacerte la inocente siempre. Tú debes saber dónde están las bases. ¿Dónde están? ¡Dilo! ¡Stop, López! ¡Cato! How did you get in here? Lopez, let her go. Shut up. Tato, you can't get away. Wait, you can't get away. Mama, are you all right? I'm all right. And what about the others? Don't worry. They are all okay. Thank God. No time to lose. Let's get to the Independence Memorial Square. You're absolutely right. Is it a power failure? I don't think so. 
Someone must have killed the power. Shit! What do we do? Grab the holes. We took too much time just to get up here. Steve might be waiting for us. Let's hurry. Yeah. That must be the helicopter Steve was talking about. Lopez! I thought you were dead! Get off my back! I cut off! There is something I need. 
from Pachamama. Por qué odias tanto a las guerrillas de las montañas? Es mi venganza. Venganza? Recuerdas que los terroristas bombardearon con violencia hace tres años. Los terroristas al intentar bombardear al gobierno mataron a muchos civiles. Sí. Y esa bomba mató a mi querida familia y las guerrillas de la montaña fueron responsables de ese bombardeo. Ese día juré que me vengaría por la muerte de mi familia. Ahora, tú sabes por qué les odio tanto. ¿Dónde están las bases de operaciones secretas? Espera, López. Yo sinceramente no sé nada. Es verdad, tenemos contacto con ellos, pero yo no los conozco bien. Yo no sé dónde están sus bases secretas. Entiendo. Entonces, tú no me sirves de nada. No me dejas alternativa. Tenéis que morir todos. ¿Qué está pasando? ¡Mierda! ¡Alguien ha estropeado la luz!
can't shoot. It's too dark. What's going on? Why is it so dark up here? Steve, is that you? Julia? Where the hell are you? We're on the next building. Steve, turn on the light. What? Turn on the light right now. Steve, hurry up! This must be it! Now! Ah. Oh. Paco, are you all right? Yeah. We have to move right away. De nada. Esto es el fin.
for the Independence Memorial Square. not broken out yet. It looks like we made it in time. Miren todos! It's Pachamama! Pachamama está viva! A presidential election followed under UN monitoring and Pachamama was inaugurated as president. This is the whole story of my own experiences during the incident. 